As the top scorer in the league, no surprise to see our cameras affixed to him during the warm-up. Can he add to his tally today? We'll find out soon. Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. My name is Derek Ray, and with me is my commentary partner, Lee Dixon. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Barcelona, and they take on Real Valladolid. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Always my favourite time of the week, spending time with you at games. We shall be in for a belter here with these two. It doesn't matter for how long you've been covering this great game of football. It's still a joy to watch Lionel Messi at his best, and he very often is at his best, Lee. Well, very few players I'd pay good money to watch, and I'd pay a ticket entrance for him, that's for sure. Every single game he plays, he gives me something, even if he doesn't play well. Just watching him move on the pitch is just fantastic. A match to look forward to. Barcelona kick-off. This is what we expect from the Blaugrana. Marc-André Ter Stegen starts in goal. Clément Langlais plays alongside Piquet in the middle of the defence. And Luis Suarez will be the main striker here. Good ball movement and a decent position here for Barcelona. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Wow, what a lovely control finish. Bobby Charlton used to say, pass the ball into the net. He certainly did that. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, all the hard work has paid off, but the manager knows a lot more has to be done to secure this game. So, back underway, and it's Barcelona holding the advantage. Nacho, can they switch to an even higher gear? Magnificent defending. Well, Barcelona were too strong for their opponents in the last match against Real Madrid. How will they fare today, Lee? Well, Derek, that sees them in position for promotion now, but they just need to keep that momentum going with another good performance today. It's going to be a tight running. It did look on for them, but not to be. The goalkeepers have to be mindful that long shots like that can come in. Yeah, I always look at goalies and say, do your job, keep the ball out the net. Good job we didn't let that one in. Waldo. It's with Sandro. It looks promising. Strongly in, PK. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Far from a good pass. Now, this might pay dividends. Attacker versus keeper, and keeper wins. Oh, I always put my money on the attacker. Not this time. Brilliant goalkeeping. And firing it into the area. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Getting forward. And there's the feed into the box. A decisive clearance it was. Let's join Alan McAnally because there's been a goal in the Atletico match. Alan. It's a goal for Atletico Madrid. It's been scored by Diego Costa. A bit of a goal mouth scramble. And he managed to... Griezmann! What an important piece of defending. And over comes the corner. And it's in! A goal for Barcelona! A goal for the Blaugrana! Can they be stopped now?
Well, my initial opinion was to blame the goalkeeper, but here we get a better angle of it. Absolutely nothing it can do. A huge deflection. Keeper, no chance. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. It's going their way. 2-0. And apologies to Alan McAnally for having to cut him off. To confirm, Atletico have scored in that game. And their lead stands at 1-0 presently. Genuinely thought they might cash in on that occasion, but haven't been able to do so. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. This looks promising. Well, he's outplayed and outthought him. The outcome is a goal kick here. More football for you to enjoy from La Liga coming up here on EA TV. It's Barcelona against Levante. Yeah, the fixtures come in thick and fast. Should be a good game, that. Though hopefully that's not the commentator's curse. Antonito, Fede, Unal, not what he was intending, bad pass, and a strong tackle. An attack full of promise, can they make the connection here? Well, as you can see, Barca haven't had too much of the ball, but they won't mind with that, they're winning this game. They're sucking their opponents onto them. And with the pace they've got in midfield and up front, they're really causing problems. Artur. Suarez. Frankie de Jong. De Jong. Piquet. Artur has it. Jordi Alba. Griezmann. Messi in the vicinity. And putting his body on the line. A bit sloppy in possession. And now this is Longley. Griezmann. Now Jordi Alba. Artur. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. De Jong. They've regained possession. Ruben Alcaraz. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. That could well be his final warning. He's got to tread carefully from here on in. Well, he has, yeah, but it's quite easy for the referees to throw yellow cards around willy-nilly, but not on this occasion. Well, he's given a corner, their referee. Well, we're highlighting Lionel Messi for a reason. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders out there, Lee. Well, his overall game is top draw, but his quality when it comes to finding the back of the net is there for all to see. And we've seen it again here today. And crossed in there. And a half-baked clearance. Oh, he's given the ball away. The cross played over and worked it. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. Well, just the sort of thing we expect from Lionel Messi in the first half, Lee. Well, Derek, he's had a stormer, hasn't he? Scored a goal. He's certainly troubled all the defenders around there as well. I think there's more to come in the second half. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Messi. Suarez. Sergi Roberto. Went in strongly, decisively. And a goal I'm hearing at the Metropolitano. Alan McAnally can tell us a lot more. It's a third goal for Atletico Madrid. 48 minutes played, 3-0.
Alan McAdally keeping us right up to date. All in all, a broken counter-attack. Lionel Messi. And a quick reminder, we've got more football from La Liga coming up for you live here on EA TV. It's Real Valladolid, and they'll be facing Mallorca. Yeah, it's very easy to build a case for those. Antoine Griezmann can celebrate his goal. Let's look at this again. We've all hit these in training. First time, bang in the back of the net. Look at the calmness of it. Technique, brilliant. Well, let's have another view of that goal. So they restart the game and only one team in it. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Lionel Messi. 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 Well, the pass from Messi, but not quite accurate enough. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. And he was in the right place to intercept. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Both substitutes who've been getting ready will come on at the same time. Ruben Alcaraz. And they'll have to throw it back in play. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Messi. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Might really be able to trouble them here. And the referee has given the advantage to Barca, firing it towards goal putting his body on the line and the defender takes care of business and Lionel Messi giving it away not really like him now Busquets Good ball movement and a decent position here for Barcelona. Throw in forthcoming for Barca. Well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. And I must say, that was a very promising attack. The alarm bells were sounding. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. And in the second half here, and it's almost, Lee, a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Well, this Barcelona team make creating and scoring goals look easy. I can tell you it's not. It's the hardest thing to do on a football pitch. But they've ticked all the boxes tonight for me, Barcelona. Lovely to watch. And look, the players have all got smiles on their faces. What more can we ask? On and on he goes. Messi cutting in from the flank. Barcelona have lost possession. Couldn't keep it. And the pass weighted by Suarez. Busquets. And up for grabs off the keeper. And thumped away. De Jong, he could pick out a teammate. Regain possession. Suarez. 
An example of a goalkeeper on top of his game, Lee. Well, that is genius. Absolutely genius. <laughs> Messi with the corner. Well, you can see he was feeling the pressure, but gave it a go anyway. Not close, though. Well, it was definitely worth the chance. Just got the technique a little bit off. News of a goal at the Metropolitano. Alan McAnally can fill us in. It's another goal for Atletico Madrid. It's been scored by Saul. He made no mistake after latching on to a long ball, hit more in hope than guile. Five minutes remain, 4-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. It needs useful looking ball. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, we can take another look at this. There's nothing much the keeper can do. Close range finish, really good play, and he doesn't miss from there. Substitution time it is. So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Lionel Messi. Options in the centre. He takes aim, almost his second goal of this match, but the goalkeeper had his own views on that subject. Well, he'd be looking for a brace, the striker, not to be on that occasion. Corner kick played in. De Jong. Messi gliding through the gears Lionel Messi the crossbar got in the way oh goodness he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team and now it is truly final the match is over He's really quiet. He usually bosses around everywhere, Lionel Messi. Your thoughts on the Messi performance, Lee? Well, obviously, first concern is do you win the game? They've done that. He played very well as well. He's got his goal. He nearly had another one as well. Hit the woodwork. His teammates will be very pleased with that performance.